Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'll be doing a Fashion Nova haul for you guys. I think it's pretty obvious that I basically live and breathe in Fashion Nova. So I'm gonna give you guys a little disclaimer that um, yes, Fashion Nova does sponsor me. I think I started working with them about a year ago. I don't know how long it has been. But I've always been a huge fan of Fashion Nova ever since they started up and it's crazy how like big they are right now. So the title of the video is what I really feel about Fashion Nova. So I'm just gonna give you guys like a genuine review of everything. And I've always been a fan. I don't think I need to say anymore because literally like if you look at my Instagram, like I'm always wearing Fashion Nova. It has always been a like long existing thing. Like my closet has a lot. Of Fashion Nova. So they sent me about like 10 items so I'm just gonna like do a little try on haul for you guys and uh, show you guys what I got. I just realized this is my first video ever since I cut my bangs. Okay so for those of you who have not uh, purchased on Fashion Nova before, if you have followed me for like a while or you know or you do follow me on Instagram, you do know that I am on the very very petite side like I'm not very petite but like I'm on the petite side so like I'm not like very curvy like I wouldn't say that I am super petite because I don't think I mean like I am in height but I don't think I'm like super like skinny or anything Fashion Nova is very 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 popular for their jeans because they have um, so many choices and they have so many types of designs and even if like your waist is really small but your ass is really big it's very very stretchy uh, i feel most fashion over jeans like are stretchy and they can fit like pretty much like any size and i really love that they go from like a small size to like a plus size i think it's just really great that they're all like size inclusive yeah it does fit right but sometimes the jeans can not be as hugging as i want it to be i don't really have an s you know <laughs> But all in all, if I really get like the skinny jeans and stuff, it fits me um, very well. And it's actually like body hugging, but at the same time like not too tight and not too like rigid. I am gonna start on the haul. I will not talk so much anymore. Okay, so I'm actually going to like Japan, right? I decided to get myself like a few like winter coats so that I will not freeze. I don't think I've been to like a really 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 super cold country for a very long time already ever since I, I don't even know I have no idea when was the last time I went to a super 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 cold country uh, I decided to get myself some jackets because clearly can't fit in my jackets from last time and you know winter jackets as a kid it's not very flattering and like the pictures I aren't gonna look very nice so I got myself um, some new jackets for the trip so I can take some cute pictures because priorities, right? I totally forgot how to do hauls, honestly. So I got this black jacket. So it has like fur on the top. And... Oh yeah, inside, inside it's also furry as well. Which is gonna be like really, really comfortable. So I think this will look really, really cute. Okay, I'm gonna do something different today where I don't say the word cute so much in a haul. It's so common when you go on YouTube and you actually like go watch a haul and I promise you if you took a shot for every time like a YouTuber does a haul and says cute um, I'm sure you guys know that you'll be either like really really drunk or you have alcohol poisoning if you guys want to play this game on my video you can totally do it so let's see how many times I say cute oh yeah and this jacket is like really unique because usually it's like this like the neck area that has fur but but there's like two like fur patches on the side as well so I thought it would be really you know different a different piece to add into my closet for the material of this it doesn't feel so thick on the outside but when you put like your arm inside it actually feels like it can really really keep you warm therefore this jacket is not super heavy compared to other winter jackets the next piece is I know you guys love hauls that's why I'm like kind of excited that I'm doing a fashion of a haul because I realized that you guys are always asking me for hauls so here it is okay the next one is um, like a white jacket white winter jacket what do you call this material again 
half jackets. This is like a Michelin baby actually. You know I showed this jacket to my mom and you know what she said? Why does it look like a quilt cover? I'm just like mom you don't know fashion. Yeah, okay, she knows fashion, but she thinks this is like a quilt cover. I'll show her how this can look good, okay? Alright, so the next piece, I decided to get like a basic because I actually really, really love basic dressers because I feel like basic dressers, it's very easy to match, especially uh, with like different bags that you want to carry. Okay, so I really, really love Fashion Nova's basics. You don't want to think about what to wear, just throw on like a basic bodysuit. And the basic bodysuit can be like low neck, or like a straight cut and you know when you throw it on with like jeans or like shorts and you know you wear heels it already looks like really nice if I have a really like fancy ass skirt and I don't want to clash with something that has like too much prints or whatever going on I'll just throw on like basics and you know it's like a staple in your closet you can have like many types of like basic bodysuits and many types of basic like crop tops yep so I got this uh, nude dress it looks very much like what Kylie Jenner would wear I know this is not true for you maybe but for me Kylie Jenner made like this like nude basic dress like a thing for me if you give me 10 nude basic dresses that you know a guy will be like they look all the same but I'll just tell you like why each one is just like different from the other and I can just buy everything and just have 10 basic nude dresses in my closet okay the next thing that I got is are these bottoms what is it called? Everlong Moto Pants. I have been waiting uh, for a long time. I sound like I, I want a lot of things in life. I have waiting to get a pair of really nice um, black Moto Pants. And I think these, I'm not sure if these were like out of stock for a while and they, and they stocked it up. They actually like replace our stocks really fast. However much pants I have in the closet, I still feel like I do not have enough. So it's just these simple uh, Moto Pants with zips here and like a um, what do you call this the knee pad the knee area how do I explain I don't think I have anything like this in my closet maybe like one no actually I don't so this is a really really good addition to my overflowing closet and I would definitely start selling uh, my pre-loved clothes and usually when I sell my clothes I wear them about two or three times but okay like some of them I, I, I only wear like once or twice so don't worry I will sell everything that is good condition in good condition uh, yeah just stay tuned to my Instagram when I start selling my clothes you know 2020 gotta clear the closet make space for more I have this obsession with these kind of shorts what, what 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 do you call what do you call these kind of shorts again? I have a lot of like these kind of shorts. I have it in green, I have it in red. These all look really good. Usually I like to pair it with knee-high socks, like high-rise socks, and like a tube top or like yeah, any any crop top honestly. You'll look good with a bodysuit as well. I've wanted this also for a long time. It is a mini red dress. And this is not any ordinary red dress, okay guys? So this dress is cross bag. Yep, and I am also actually thinking of wearing this um, on Chinese New Year because it's red. I think like everyone hates me because you know, I don't really follow like the color scheme of Chinese New Year. I'm always like, you know what? I'm gonna wear black if I wanna wear black. No wonder, you know, bad luck. I'm just asking for it and then I complain why my life is so sad. Okay, personally, I feel like it's so hilarious that everyone in this generation jokes about like how sad their life is and everybody will just understand what you're talking about everybody will just laugh like oh my god I just want to fucking die and like you know when your parents hear it or your grandparents hear it they'll be like they'll scold you like my grandmother would like hit me like she'll like literally like don't say that you know like because they take it so seriously but this generation is like you know screw it you know if I die tomorrow I die you know it's what it is <laughs> every time when I want to shoot it starts raining that's why I'm like no I'm not gonna rely on the sunlight I'm gonna use a ring light see we grow we grow we grow every day we grow every day okay the next thing is um, a red sequin dress I actually wanted to wear this for one of the wedding but 
I kind of ordered this a little bit like too late so so I'm deciding to just keep this in my closet until there comes an event where I can actually wear this dress if you want to be bling you want to be bling bling and ching ching um, any day even if you want to go to the hawker center it's okay you do you girl you know so I got this red sequin dress <laughs> it is like literally boom in your face so it's just like this red tube sequin dress very simple but not simple at the same time it looked really good on the sides so I'm like yes I need it I have an unhealthy obsession over clothes my closet is so full right it's like stacked up to the top on one side the little bitch that I am and so lazy to you know, dig for my clothes. Yesterday I dig for my clothes. I made effort because like, you know, you don't want your clothes to like, you know when you dig your clothes like fall down and then you gotta like fold it and pack it again. I'm just like, I ain't gonna do that shit on like every other day. So yesterday was the only day I actually, I actually like dug my old clothes and like tried to find something new to wear. Uh, so I usually just rely on what I buy. So I buy, I wear, and I wash it in the closet and the cycle just repeats, guys. It's unhealthy, so I'm gonna make an effort to take out everything and I am going to sell my pre-love items, you know? Okay, so I got this green dress. Haha. <laughs> Sequin, again. As you can see, like, the front, it kind of, like, hangs loose and I am in love with the back. I actually did not take a look at the back before I get I got this because I'm like nope the front looks amazing I'm getting it. I love the back even more because it dips down low. Honestly I wish I already had like a back tattoo right now because it would look so good. Two sequin dresses for two events. Hopefully there's another wedding. It's like, oh, you're getting married? Oh my god, that's amazing. Oh my god, so I can wear my dress. <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. No, I'm, I'm not kidding. <laughs> I'm gonna close the balcony door, guys. Uh, now we're down to the last three pieces. Okay, it's like a long sleeve top. And as you can see, up close. So it's held on by like a like diamond chain. And you can make like a knot in the middle so that when I move, it doesn't just like boop. And that'll be the end of my life. That's nasty. That is nasty. One of my favorite pieces in the haul actually. Okay, this last clothing piece, I actually wanted to get this for a while. I feel like I say the same thing for everything. I want to get a lot of things for a long ass time, but I just don't because I'm like a really good girl and I just like save money. My mom would completely like disagree with that. She's like, oh my god, then why do you party so much? So it's just this diamond top. This has been going around for a while now. Uh, it has been like a, I think it has been an ongoing trend for about a few years already. But I never had the balls to do it. If you use nipple stickers before, those that you can reuse, sometimes when you sweat and you're not wearing some, you're not wearing a top, I just stop touching your boots. When, you, when you're not wearing a top that is like very tight, it might fall off if um, you know you sweat. It might get a little bit loose. It might not fall off but it'll get a little bit loose, you know. And Singapore is not like cold, it's humid, it's hot. You go to a club, you dance. And I don't want to be like in the club and then suddenly there's a nipple sticker like on the fucking floor. Like that is just embarrassing and straight up like... I would like, this is like social suicide if I, I actually do that. Okay, so if you don't know how this works, right? It's basically like held on by this. I think if I wear this top, I'll probably get like high key anxiety because I don't know, I, I'm scared like what if it breaks? If it breaks, my one book will be like out. But you know, it's a risk that I'm willing to fucking take, guys. So as you can see, the bag is the same as well. But this is a really, really nice, nice piece. So yeah, wish me luck, my friends. Okay, the last one are shoes. Fashionable shoes. Look at me, so excited. Honestly, I'll tell you guys that I've never been happier doing what I do. I know that something excites me when I cannot sleep at night. And I just keep thinking about that, some, that one thing. And you know, sometimes when like, before I do like a YouTube video, I can't sleep at night because I'm just like thinking about so, like the things I want to do like in the video and like how excited I am to shoot something. So 
like this wouldn't be possible without like you guys supporting me so I love you guys thank you so much <laughs> I sound so ungrateful I love you guys thank you so much ah! I'm trying to open a box how do you do this okay decided to get something different for myself I think y'all are sick of me like wearing my black color boots every time like those Chelsea boots that is like my ultimate staple because last time I threw like a few away already because they were old but last time I had like three fucking Chelsea boots guys three three Chelsea boots because it's so easy to match okay so I got these nude heels and it's um, not your ordinary nude heels so this is like transparent and the heel is transparent as well and so uh, there are three buckles it goes slightly up your leg and I don't know I think uh, I saw Bradman Rock wear this, or maybe he wore something else. I don't remember. But he got something similar. Okay, so thank you so much for watching um, this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my haul and what I picked from Fashion Nova. I will link everything down in the in the in the description box below. I know I've said this line like a million times, but I still can't say it right. It's like a it's like a freaking tongue twister to me. I'll link everything below that I've gotten in this haul. So if y'all want to get the same thing, it's going to be easy for you. So do comment down below if you guys want me to do... Something again. <laughs> I haven't had anything to eat today. It's just air, man. So what I was saying is that if you guys want me to do um, a Japan haul, I will gladly do it for you guys and I'll show you what I actually bought from Japan. I don't know what to expect because I haven't been there in forever and I'm going to Disneyland. I'm so excited. I will also be doing, uh, I will also be like vlogging in Japan and I know that Japan 7-Eleven has the best kind of like food. So I will be picking some things out of 7-Eleven and actually, you know, maybe I'll do like a ASMR with my dad or my mom or something. Thank you so much for watching my video and I'll see you guys in my next video. If you guys have any questions, just comment down below and I will answer it. If you haven't followed me on Instagram, here is my Instagram blog. Like shameless blog. So yeah, see you guys in my next video. Bye! Okay, I'm so sorry that I did not add this beforehand. But I am giving away um, about four or five pieces from the same haul that I just showed you guys. So all you have to do is go on my Instagram. Follow the instructions in the caption and I'll pick one lucky winner that I'll send all these items to and I also showed like what I'm gonna send. All my items are in size small. I'm like a size 34. So if you're the same size as me and you want to win these items or you want to win this for a friend, just head over to my Instagram and follow the instructions and I'll pick one lucky winner and I hope it's you. <laughs> so yeah, I'll see you guys once again. <laughs> Bye!